I'll get it. Hi, I'm Rich with Inside HPC. We're here at SC12 in Salt Lake City, and we're here at the Bull booth <laughs> at SC12. Pascal, let, let's just start at the beginning. Who is Bull, and who do you help? Yeah, well, Bull is a, a um, European-based uh, IT company with a very strong focus on HPC. And um, well, our motto is Instruments for Innovation, and I guess that sums up pretty well what we do. Uh, we provide tools uh, to scientists, for example, to help them innovate faster. And we provide tools, for example, to uh, meteorologists to help them pr um, forecast weather more precisely or more quickly. And now when I'm talking about scientists and meteorology, it's not just a random choice. Mm -hmm. I'm referring to two recent uh, successes that we have announced here at uh, SC12. Uh, we uh, are going to install two large systems at SERA in the Netherlands. Uh, that's a research uh, center. And at Meteo France, that's the French weather forecasting organization. Oh, terrific. So, you know, we had a big announcement this week. Intel launched the Intel Xeon Phi, the co-processor. Yes. What does Bull offer in that space? Well, we are showing here at SC12 the uh, Bull um, B515 uh, blade. And uh, that's a, a new blade, an accelerator blade. And it contains two CPUs coupled to two Xeon Phi's. Okay, so, so they work in ten. How many of these can we get in a rack? It looks like a very dense platform. Uh, yeah, it's uh, well, you can get nine of these in in a in a chassis, and in a, and you can have uh, five chassis in a rack. So uh, that's uh, forty five uh, blades, if I'm correct. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, that, that's right. Well, th this is very exciting. So, what kind of reaction are you getting from customers about CN5? What, what are they telling you about it? Uh, I think, yeah, they are enthusiastic. Actually, yeah. we, we have uh, worked already with some customers on the use of Xeon Phi. I mean, yeah. it, it's all very well to have uh, these new uh, co-processors, but what are we going to use to use them for? And uh, our benchmarking team has been uh, working on that for months, and they are very enthusiastic about the results they get.